With the advent of season four, it's time for our experts, Shia and Shashank, to don the hat of styling and perfectionism once again for the confident, fashion-forward brides and grooms who dream of stealing the show on their wedding day. The epicenter of a relationship is valuing each other, growing together, and respecting your partner's individuality. And if you look closely, that's what our show reflects. So let's meet another wonderful couple, Matthew and Sarah, who have decided to be part of our Nazrana family and are here to handpick the wedding attire for the groom. My name is Matt Castaneda, I'm 32 years old. I'm from Nanuet, New York. Uh, I've come today with Sarah, my fiance, uh, Josephine, my mother, and Sona, her uh, mom. My name is Sarah, I'm from New York, and I'm a pediatric nurse practitioner. I'm Josephine Castaneda, um, Matthew's mom. My name is Sona, I'm born in India. We're getting married uh, the fall of next year in Florida. We met about eight years ago at a friend's baby shower. I bumped into her one day as she was filling up balloons, and uh, I figured I have to get close to her and try filling him up. Matt proposed to me. He took me to Florida for our annual family reunion, and uh, he took me to Victoria and Albert's. We are massive Disney fans. The moment he proposed, there was a, an artist who was uh, playing on the harp, and our song came on. Um, which is from uh, Elvis Presley, Can't Help Falling In Love With You. And that same moment he proposed, it was amazing. After becoming a nurse, uh, she had a couple incidents at work where uh, she had an, uh, a small injury sustained from it. I knew immediately that I needed to be with her because I couldn't live or do anything without her. She became my entire world. Hi guys, uh, so yeah, what are we looking for today? I'm looking for a suit today for our wedding. Uh, I had a last minute change of heart of using a tuxedo. So you want a suit or you want a Shervani? I'm not 100% sure, so I would like to explore whatever you guys had. Cool, and do you have your outfit already? I do have my outfit. Okay, was it with us? Yes. Okay, yes. cool. So I'll take a look at your outfit and then I'll bring you some things based off of that. Uh, so. Um, have you tried on Indian outfits before or no? No, this will be your first time. Okay, so what I generally like to do with my grooms is show them like something simple, something medium and something heavy to kind of get a feel for like what they like, what they don't like. This way they can definitely narrow down as to things that they like. Because a lot of times I'll have grooms come in and be like, oh, I want something really simple till they put on something really nice and they're like, oh, this is what I want. Like, I didn't even know I wanted this, but this is what I want. And it could be the exact opposite, right? Like you, you come in with something heavy in mind and just like something simple. Okay. Cool? Yeah, absolutely. Okay, so let me pick a few out for you and bring them out. Great, can't wait. So Sarah, I just saw your outfit. It was beautiful. Uh, so it's all white and silver, right? Yes. Okay, how much time do we have for the wedding? So we already have everyone's outfits. Okay. Um, we even picked out an outfit from Matt. It's an American suit, but I've kind of wanted him to be in something maybe within my culture. We wanted to see how it looked like. I'm a little curious. Uh, so do we have time for custom outfits? Because I've seen your outfit and it's all white and silver. Um, so we have some options, but we don't have a ton of options. I just want to know if custom's an option or we don't have enough time for it. I don't know if we have enough time because we did place the order for the tuxes already. So let, uh, let's see. Okay, so then let's look at stock pieces, All right? I've pulled out three different kinds. Let's let's take a look at them. Ancho's gonna pull them out for you. Awesome, thank you. So Matt, the first outfit I picked for you, this is called a bandgala. It has a couple of different names. It's called bandgala, it's called an aero jacket. This is essentially the Indian version of a suit. Uh, so it's shorter, it has trousers with it. It's a very nice fusion piece. How do you feel about it? I love it. Uh, I think the length is pretty cool. Okay. The color is gorgeous. Um, I am curious to see what everybody else thinks about it, but I think it's fantastic. Okay, Josephine? I'd like to, I'd like to see it on you. Yeah. yeah. It's not what I would think in my mind of a traditional outfit, but 
never know until you try it on. Okay. Have you done some research? Uh, I've been looking, yeah. Okay. I have. I'm guessing what you've been seeing are more longer, longer. pieces. Longer. So this one here, it throws me back a little bit, but that doesn't mean anything. You could always just try it on and that might blow my mind altogether. Okay. Uh, Sarah? I like the color because it does match my outfit, but I kind of wanted something a little bit more blingy because I have a lot of bling on my outfit and I want you to match me. Okay. Is it okay if he tries it on? Of course, yeah. Okay. Auntie? Yeah, I think uh, it should be more longer and more jerry work, it will be better okay. for the wedding. So you want something heavier? Too. Right, heavy. Okay. But are you okay with him trying it on? Yeah, he can try. Okay. Cool. So yeah, yeah. let's put that in the maybe path. Alright, no problem. So the last one that I showed you was more of a medium one. This is my like over-the-top heavy one for you. So this has all over thread embroidery with pearls, silver stones, and silver jardosi on it. Um, it has hints of her because hers is all clear crystal stones. Um, so I think this would match really well. But this is again very heavy. So I want to know how you how you feel about this. I think it's gorgeous. I've never been so uh, decked out before, but <laughs> I think it's. I would love to try that on. Okay. So Josephine, how you feel on this one? I like this one a lot. It blends nicely. The only thing, remember, it's going to be in Florida. And it's going to be hot. Will be hot. That all depends on how you're going to feel in it. I particularly love it. And it's what, I think you look great with that. It's going to compliment you beautifully. Yeah. It Definitely. also comes with a belt. Uh, once he puts it on, I'll show you what that looks like, um, which is removable, of course. Uh, but we'll see how that looks. Well, how, how do you feel about this, Sarah? I, uh, I love it. Absolutely love it. I think it matches my outfit so perfectly. Okay, and you don't think it's too heavy for him, right? No, I think it's, it's perfect. Something new, something that you never had before. Uh, I think you look like a total prince. Total. <laughs> <laughs> Auntie, what about you? Yeah, I, it's more. It has a more embroidery, and it look like a heavy. Zari is good, sleeve is good too. But I want to see more. Okay, sounds good. I will have the third one. Wow, wow. So this is my more medium piece for you. It's a lighter fabric, so this is a brocade. So essentially, brocade is a woven fabric, um, as opposed to the earlier one where it was embroidered on top. This this weaving is within the fabric. But overall, decently light piece is something you'd be very comfortable in. Uh, I just didn't know how heavy or light you liked. So what's your take on this one? I think it's gorgeous. The fact that it's a little bit thinner might be better for the hotter climate. The embroidery is a lot less, but um, the way the buttons fall and the chain across the pocket, I think uh, really going to set it off nicely. What do you think? I Jason? like it. But again, I'd have to see it on him. Okay. Yeah. And D, what about you? Uh, this is the satin, so I don't like the satin, the satin cloth. But the uh, first one was silk, right? Yeah, uh, yeah. Yep, yep. So I, I will go with the uh, first one. Previous one is much better than this. Okay, but are you okay with him trying it on? or? Yeah, he can try all three. Okay. We will see. <laughs> Sounds good. So I think you like all three, so let's let's begin trying them on and we'll take it from there. Okay, so Anshul's going to bring the first one and then she's going to take you to the fitting room that way. Yeah. Is there a reason you want to wear a uh, Shivani as opposed to a tux? I want to uh, show more support toward the culture for the wedding. It'll match the theme better. Okay. So Matt, do you know what is a Shivani? I don't. Oh, because the India and the American, the, when they do the Christian wedding, they do the tuxedo. So same, uh, so Indian, they put, they put the Shivani, it means long. And it can be short too, but that's a lot of embroidery. So it can be heavy and light too. Okay. Yeah, it's essentially the Indian version of a tux. It gives you the least range of motion, <laughs> Yeah, uh, like but it, it looks the sharpest. Like a prince, uh, prince wear all time in India, something like that. Okay. Yeah, I'd like to see that. I would like to see that too. Yeah. Nice. How's it going, Matt? This is beautiful. I love it. Yeah, it's a little ill-fitting. It, it is fitting. Um, wasn't very hard to get into. Yeah, I mean, it's just a little loose on you. It can be taken care of. That's not an issue. Gotcha. Uh, but overall, you like it? I do. I think this is great. It looks wonderful in the mirror. Um, it's can you a move little... forward? Oh, sorry. The chest yes. is nice, but I want to see the rest. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, a little mean, bit more. A little bit you, more. Don't be afraid. What do you girls think? Mm -hmm. Nice. It looks very nice. Wow, I love the embroidery on the top. The embroidery is gorgeous. 
It is. Do you think it's too short? That looks like a regular tuxedo, yeah. like a regular suit. Yeah, it is the Indian version of a suit. This to me, personally, I like this if you're doing um, a, a party or you're going to somebody else's wedding. Yeah. But for you, you it's beautiful, be, but... I like it a lot, but I, I would like to be a little bit yeah. longer. Yeah, okay. If it was longer than that, I would have said yeah. Gotcha. Okay, uh, so let's try the next one. Yes. Yeah. So the first Shivani I put on, um, I thought it was great. Um, the texture was beautiful. I did feel it was a little on the short side. Um, going by the pictures I've seen, um, I think there would have been a better fit if it was longer for me. I also showed Matt the bungala because I know he was going for a tux, but he just wanted to pay respect to the to Sarah's cultural side. Um, so this is like a very good compromise because it it is the Indian version of a suit. Okay. Uh, Matt, you look handsome in this one. You? Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Matt, so you look that handsome. Looks, I think this is okay, gorgeous. Let me see the cloth. What cloth is this? Uh, this look. Oh, wow. wow. Gorgeous. Let me see. Yeah, what cloth? What material is this? The base is raw silk, I Oh, that's so beautiful. The embroidery, embroidery is, is gorgeous. Good too. I never would have thought this something. is a belt? It comes with a belt. I mean, it's removable. You don't have but, to have Matt, it can you take out the belt? Can we see without, without the belt? The belt? Uh, yeah, sure. You mind? You're not gonna fall apart now, are you? Hopefully not. Okay. I love how. Oh, Matt, look like wow. a prince. Thank you. <laughs> you look so handsome. I actually, it feels like royalty. Yeah, right. If you weren't my son. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, Sarah. <laughs> You're mine, dude. <laughs> this is. No. That's really it's beautiful. Very beautiful. It is beautiful. Right. And the back too. The back is unbelievable. Right. Mm -hmm. I, I think the other thing is this also like fits you so much better than the other one. Like yeah. stuff when when it just fits you right, it, you know, it's better. There's a jacket and there's an outfit yeah. for everybody. And I think wow. this is the one for him. This is really, really nice. This is the Sherwani. Matthew, no sword? <laughs> I don't have a sword. <laughs> I feel like I need it with this though. This is absolutely no, You don't need nothing. I'm, I'm kidding. Perfect. You Do don't you need anything. Do you think you're going to be a little hot? I may be warm, but, but you have I an think outfit it's going to be okay. That? Yeah, right. You got an outfit underneath that, yeah, right? Yeah, it has a this long shirt and it comes with pants. The purpose of that is like this one's kind of cut a little high, at least where the buttons are. So essentially, what happens is when you sit down, if you don't have the underneath layer, you can see your crotch. Uh, so and that's why you don't want to scare anybody. <laughs> <laughs> Not yet, Sarah. That's for later on. We'll have to go with this. <laughs> <laughs> so that's what we do, a, a layer of krita underneath, so, so you don't have that problem. No, that's good too because if you're dancing and everything and you get very hot, that comes off yeah. and at least you have an outfit underneath yeah. still, you yeah, know. For a little bit you can take it off. Yeah. 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 Nice have you so. seen her outfit? I have not, no. Okay. And you're not allowed to see her outfit? No, I don't want okay. to. Not until the day. We will yeah. have to give a major pow pow if he does. No. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. no sefa. This is... Do you want to try the next one or? I think we should still try it. Cool. So yeah, let's have you try the next one. Okay. It's amazing. Always. We'll be number one. Number one? Oh, that's our number one. Don't start. That's our number Don't one. Don't start crying. <laughs> that's a girl. Mm -hmm. All right, Anshul will take you. Yes, <laughs> the second one, like I told him, if he wasn't my son, I would have married him. It was, it was Perfect. The second one, there's just something about it. It knowing what Sarah's wearing, it complements it. You know, it's not taking anything away from her, but it's bringing him up, and that's the wow factor when you open up a door and you see the two of them coming in, and that's what you want. And that jacket, that outfit, is what made it for him. I'd love that one. The second one really stuck with me. I noticed. The embroidery on it was gorgeous, and from what I've heard through hints, I know that Sarah's dress is also going to be embroidered similarly, so uh, I don't want to steal her fire or anything, but I think that's going to be the, the, a great choice depending on what the girls say. How do you feel, Matt? Uh, I like it. It's a lot lighter. Okay. Definitely is. The fitment's really good. You know, but it's not um, it's not as as blingy as the other one is. I did like the especially because I've heard from Sarah that your dress is pretty uh, it's embroidered. It's bling. So. 
it's blinked. What do you girls think? Yeah, I thought I don't like I that like satin, but it's amazing. Mm -hmm. It's yeah. very good fitting. Like it's it. very nice, but I don't know. It doesn't wow me like the second one. Okay. The, the other one. It, you look better than me in my dress. <laughs> oh, do you better. want that though? <laughs> yeah, do you want me to look I, better than you? I think no. you, sh you, sh you shine. Like that, that suit, like you said before, right? That suit. You want it to, right, like certain jackets, certain suits mm -hmm. are made for the person. Yeah. And yeah. this one, it doesn't really say much, no. you know? Okay. It's nice. But I do the love the uh, embroidery on the collar. It's nice. It's and very this. subtle. Yeah. It's, it's very, mm -hmm. very subtle. Definitely. But I think for and your special like day, it should be yeah. that mm -hmm. second one. Second yeah, you got to go right, all yeah. out, but dude. You got to shine, too. Yeah. You know? Oh. Like when you come in, that's the wow factor. <laughs> when they open the door, yeah. I mean, she's already in a wow. Yeah, I know. Okay? She's a wow. So we can't leave you out. So when you come through that door, yeah. it's got to be the punch. Yeah. And that other one was the punch. Yeah. Yes. Mm -hmm. I think that makes, this is a tap. makes the decision yeah. easy then. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So are you 100% sure you like the previous outfit? Girls? Yes. Yes. Uh, yes. Yeah? I'm 100% sure. Okay, so let me ask you our question. Are you ready to be a Nasrana groom? I am ready to be a Nasrana groom. All right, congratulations, Thank man. Thank you. Thank you, guys. All right, we have Thank a small you. gift for you. The bill. <laughs> Let her come back. That's not a small, that's a big gift. <laughs> so this is our little gift to you. Check it out. Thank you. Oh, we all get one. Wow. See what it says. Oh. Oh. Yes. I'm calm. I'm great. <laughs> great. Thank you. Man. Thank you very much. Congratulations, ladies. Thank you. Thank you. I very thoroughly enjoyed this appointment. Like Josephine was was a ball. Uh, she was just such a good time. It's also nice to be able to guide someone who's not from your culture, and sort of give them the ropes. Um, and especially with Matt because. He pretty much liked on everything he had on. I, I was just amazed that he liked the most blingiest outfit. So it's, it's cool to see that. So I, I very thoroughly enjoyed this appointment. I'm very excited about the wedding and Nizrana was, the entire experience was amazing. It was very much worth it. Can't wait. Can't wait. I'm holding back the tears right now. Because seeing them, I just can't wait. It's the most beautiful thing I could possibly wish for. And it's happening. Well, the Nazrana team wishes Matthew and Sarah a bountiful life and a fantastic wedding ahead. If you like this video, hit like, comment, share, and subscribe to our channel, Nazrana Diaries.